Hey everyone, Heather Earls here. Thanks for coming on today's episode. This week, like every week, I'll be talking about natural living and healthy tips that will get you to rethink how you live and what products or habits you can easily change to better your life. So let's get started. Hey everyone, welcome to this week's Urban Wisdom. Our topic this week is coconut oil and sea salt face scrub. Each year, I work on getting as many toxins out of my life and home as possible. And I'm sure that's why you're listening to this podcast too. This simple idea of health has opened my eyes, and I'm sure yours, to the many simple ingredients we so often take for granted. In short, it shouldn't take a label that covers an entire product to tell you the list of ingredients. The list instead should hold very few ingredients that are easily read. For instance, this face scrub we are making today has two elements, coconut oil and sea salt. What is coconut oil? Coconut oil or copra oil is an edible oil extracted from the kernel or meat of mature coconuts harvested from the coconut palm. It has various applications and because of its high saturated fat content, it is slow to oxidize. Now you guys, for healthy skin, applying a coconut oil extract to human skin may enhance its protective barrier functions and have an anti-inflammatory effect. And that um, was reported from a study in 2017. Well, then what is pink Himalayan salt? Well, pink Himalayan salt is a type of rock salt from the Punjab region of Pakistan near the foothills of the Himalayans. And you guys, if I pronounce that incorrectly, I apologize. Pink Himalayan salt is chemically similar to table salt, contains up to 98% sodium chloride. The rest of the salt consists of trace minerals such as potassium, magnesium, calcium. These give the salt its light pink tint. These minerals also explain why Himalayan salt tastes different from regular table salt. Now the primary uses are as food additive and in cooking. However, it's also used in spa treatments, aiding people and their health. Two simple yet very effective ingredients we are using today to create our coconut oil and sea salt face scrub. And guys, I'd just like to give you a little background on what products we're using, even if they're natural products. A lot of people out there don't understand what's in them, so that's why I like to give you a little um, buffer course there at the beginning. Now, right into coconut oil and sea salt face scrub. We're going to get right into it. Ingredients and items needed. Well, you need the coconut oil and pink Himalayan sea salt. Then you need a jar with a lid, labels, which are optional, a funnel, and spoon. Now, to make, take your jar of choice and mix one part melted coconut oil with two parts of sea salt. You want to mix together with a spoon and then let cool so the coconut oil solidifies. If you have labels, place one of those on top of your jar. If not, then um, in a short while, like a week, I'm going to be having um, downloadable um, labels that you can get off my website, which is heatherearls.com slash face scrub. And I actually have a picture of them there too. And or you can create your own. These are perfect to dress up your jar for home use and or to give the coconut oil scrub away as a gift. It just kind of dresses up the jar. That's it. You're now finished. I told you this was going to be an easy one this week. Now all you have to do to use is dampen your skin and take a small amount out of your jar using your fingers or a spoon and lightly rub onto your skin in a circular motion moving outward on your face and neck area. Do this for a couple of minutes and then rinse off with warm water. Pat dry with a clean towel. You can use this face scrub daily to help with acne, to remove dead skin, or to gain a more youthful looking appearance. If you don't want the salt creating a mess in your sink, apply the sea salt scrub during a shower. Well, that's it, you guys. Enjoy, and we'll talk to you again next week. Thanks for listening to today's episode of Urban Wisdom and Natural Living. Tune in next week where I'll broadcast live every Monday morning at 8 a.m. If you miss it live, hold those tears and head on over to my blog, which is heatherearls.com. That's Heather, E-A-R-L-E-S.com. There you can have 24-7 access or right here on iTunes. If you want to follow me on social media, you'll find me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, and Pinterest. 
Have a healthy week. Thank you.